I know a lot of you uh, won't take me extremely serious because the baseball hat and whatever else, but that's that's your problem if you can't see past that to try to hear what I'm actually trying to say. And the point is this. I believe that if cannabis was legal across the entire planet for anyone to grow however they wished, there would be no more poverty. No more. Zero. If you doubt that, just think of the ramifications of making it legal. Would there be too much, the price would go down, etc. Go ahead and think about it because I have. And if you can come at me with something, put it in the comments that I haven't thought of, that'd be great because I think, of course, the price would go down, but what would happen? There can never be too much weed. Cannabis. It's not marijuana, by the way, because that's its slave name. That's a terrible name. That's when it all got messed up. They voted it in by saying this new drug's in town called marijuana, and it's turning white people black and all this shit. And people were like, what? And they banned it, and then it became, you know, this evil marijuana drug. But that's not the name. It's cannabis, and it's full of medicine and food and oil, and we can run our cars off it, and we can heal each other with it and, and uh, smoke it, eat it. All sorts of shits full of nutrients and vitamins that you couldn't even name the vast quantities of them. Which is why there can never be too much weed. So of course the price would go down. And then uh, what would you do? You'd have to you'd have to sell it, swap it, trade it. Uh, oil, food, medicine, like I said, there's millions of uses, food, food, clothing, you know, whatever. Building materials. So you can always sell it. There's always gonna be a market for it. And not only that, but it's it can be grown anywhere, almost anywhere, but you know, except extreme Arctic conditions. And there's even some strains that actually can be grown way up there, but so yeah, I mean, even Africa. They could be growing this shit anywhere and it would end poverty because everyone have a big old bag of weed and they could just bring it into town and sell it, either as food, fuel, medicine, smoke, whatever. And there's tons of different flavors, so of course they want to swap different flavors and try this and try that. And it's just one of those things that, you know, obviously corporations have a massive hand in this because of the amount of money they make in the timber industry, the cotton industry, the paper industry, uh, so on and so forth, building construction materials, pharmaceuticals, uh, you know, Alzheimer's, even this whole ALS thing. Th these are all things that could be uh, cured and reversed with cannabis oil. Obviously, cancer itself, Rick Simpson. But a lot of people know this stuff. A lot of people choose to ignore it and want to believe in the hype of this whole 1932 ruling of marijuana turning white people black and all this crazy shit. And I promise you, it's like pretty much that. And that's how it became illegal. If people knew that it was hemp, they wouldn't have voted to make it illegal. And that's how the story goes. They go, it's only like three minutes. I don't want to bore you because I know your attention span at this point in reality is like six seconds so I'll be lucky to even get this far with you but I think a hundred million percent that if a cannabis if cannabis was legal across the entire planet to, for us to do whatever the fuck we wanted with it there'd be no more poverty and it's pretty bad because there's 30,000 people dying right now of not having food or water and not to mention the people that can be healed from it and fed from it etc so consider that consider this indeed and talk about it because this is a major breakthrough i mean if i'm right which I'm, there's only one way to find out right we just see here's the plan we can do a, a, a massive organization of planting just all over the entire planet and what they're going to do if there's just a million plants growing everywhere on every roundabout on every street corner and every wooded area and every sidewalk in the millions just dumped into rivers and just growing everywhere, just blowing in the wind. What would they do indeed? But now I've spoken too long, it's 420, I gotta go. Peace.